Okay, I'm here with Robbie and Daniel from Cajun Dance Party. Guys, uh, Oxygen, you're here at last. What yeah, took you so yeah. long? <laughs> uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Well, we haven't been we haven't been doing much of anything for a long time. Um, and we, you know, we put out the first album with with basically doing nothing. Um, and it's you know only since we really finished our A levels a couple of weeks ago that we you know we've sort of got out and be able to, to be a full time band really. So this is part of um part of our very very first tour out. So. Um, you know, it's, it's sooner than a lot of places, but we're very excited to be here as well. How did you find that with doing schoolwork and and trying to be in a band as well? It was picking up quite a lot of coverage. It's pretty frustrating at times because it, um, we couldn't really give much to the people who were sort of getting excited about the music and everything. But now, but in, at the same time, it was good because we had time to. Um, you know, progress musically and stuff. Um, we didn't have to rush into anything. And we, we, we're signed to an indie label, so everything's pretty um, relaxed yeah, and, yeah, and, yeah. You're signed to an indie label, but it's like a, it's, it's kind of got like a who's who of who's cool in music at the moment, XL Records, yeah. like formerly known as the label that the prodigy were signed to, now, now no more but possibly the coolest roster of music around at the moment. How did I actually turn out? This, this must be almost like a dream come true signed to them, maybe? Well, it was interesting, you know, that um, it's interesting that they, that they should have been the ones that um, that we went for, because, uh, I mean, what, what, what's always struck me about that roster is that um, the bands on it aren't really so much defined by scenes or what's contemporary. It's more just names that, um, that have, you know, tra tra transgressed through those scenes and, um, you know, become sort of, were the artists in their own right, so like, it you know, it's, we feel very very privileged to be to, to be in that company. Um, in terms of you know how the day to day workings of you know the label um, has turned out for us, I think you know what Daniel said about it being um, fairly relaxed in terms of allowing um, their artists that freedom. That's been really important to us and allowed us to, you know, for instance, um, we chose. To, Spending a, a lot of time just working and perfecting the second, uh, the first album, and the second record will be different. It'll be more concentrated. It'll be quicker and stuff. But um, they've given us the freedom to, you know, to work in those two different ways. So that's really positive. You mentioned freedom. Did you have much freedom from your families? Like when you were studying, were you allowed to do stuff, or were you kind of like, no, get into that room and do some study or something like that? Uh, yeah, no. I mean, it, yeah, we had, we could do what, what we wanted, really. Any aspirations to what, what, what grades you might get, or is that just, oh, we just don't want to know? Oh, God, it's different for everyone in the band, you know? I mean, you, you say pressure from families, but ultimately, you know, if, if we wanted to do the work, that's coming from us, you know? So, you know, is, and it's like the band, you know? We're not going to be a... It's just like the band, you can't have managers or, or labels pressuring you into writing the songs and stuff. It's got to come from you. So it's, it works in exactly the same way. It's slightly more, yeah. I'm trying to, you're trying to tell my mother that, like, no, no way, that's not going to work at all. Hey, you're mine, I raised you and all that. We're so having an interview about our A levels. Yeah. That's really great. Ah, listen. You know, you got to do it. But listen, guys, pleasure to meet you. Um, best of luck with the set, and I uh, hope to see you back very, very soon. Thanks very much for having us. So.